both teams here, Hampton and Elizabeth City State, looking to start off 2019 well, on the uh, you know the right foot. Hampton begins their inaugural season in the Big South. Hampton fan base really wants to see what they've got at quarterback now with Francois. You see him down there warming up on the sideline as the special teams unit will head out onto the field. He's in going. Going to fake the play action to McKenzie. Francois over the middle to his tight end. Pitch and catch made there by number 88, Paul Richard Jr. out of Detroit. He's there. Third and goal here. Francois under pressure. Going to run from it. He's going to tuck it. He's going to be able to walk across the goal line. Touchdown, Pirates. Francois able to walk into the end zone. And the Pirates put six on the board here on the opening drive. The right one, top of the formation. Francois looks over the D. He's got plenty of time. Under pressure, steps through the pressure, crosses the 45 to the 40, still on his feet across the 30, 25 to the 20 before he's forced out of bounds and wisely avoids contact after a 30-yard pickup on the ground. Great run by Francois. You could tell they were trying to take advantage of Bonds and his six foot four frame. They go back to him and somehow, some way, breakdown in coverage. Rodriguez, the DB, was looking in another direction, and Bonds walks right into the end zone for the easy touchdown. It's come out four receivers. Looks like Robinson's the single back in the backfield. No, it's Bell in the backfield. They're going to give it to him. He's going to turn the corner to 20, 25. He's hit. The ball came loose. He took a massive shot. Francois steps through. Going to put it on himself here. The run up the middle to the 40. Wisely slides. There's going to be a late flag as his helmet came off as a Elizabeth City State defender got in his face. Got a pass to the end zone was broken up. There's going to be a pass interference on as the D DB reached out the last second and it's moving forward in this game. Francois takes it, looks right, comes over the middle, has the receiver not going to be close, and the Vikings come away with a turnover on downs. Francois in the shotgun, goes left, has a receiver, catch, and yards after the catch there by number 85. That's Dana. Dana. Second down to 10, Pirates in the four receiver set. They're going to go quick outlet to the receiver, number two, Colette, Catlett, excuse me, here 150 right, snap to Francois, looks over the middle, got plenty of time, goes right, got a receiver, makes the catch before going out of bounds, that was Graham, the junior wide receiver. The best thing about that, Bonds making the catch, rewarding his quarterback as uh, Francois took a shot there, one back spit on the backfield, that's McKenzie. Francois takes a shot to the end zone. Touchdown, Pirates! You called it right to Jadakus. Yeah, he had to get him back because he know he, he's going to look at tape and know he missed him on the post the first time, but that was a great catch by Jadakus and the one down at the bottom of the screen. Francois looks, gets it to him across the 10, inside down to the 6-7 yard line. So Pirates pick up the first down and some. And I think the officials took some pity there on Elizabeth City and just marked it the one-inch line. And that will do it here from Armstrong Stadium. It's the final three seconds take away. Hampton Pirates 65, the Elizabeth City State University Vikings 7. We thank you for joining us here on ESPN+. We'll see you next week as the Pirates play host to Virginia Union. Good night, everybody.